Hello everybody, Caden here today with another episode of The Isle. Now, if I'm correct, is that thing over there and that thing over there are hyper endocrine Tyrannosaurus Rexes. That is also a hyper endocrine Tyrannosaurus Rex. How there are so many That is like terrifying. I wanna I'm gonna run over. Let's see these guys. Probably will be the only chance I ever get in an episode to show one of these things off because, well, we all know I'm never going to get that far. I mean, what, that's like 40 billion hours worth of work? I want to see it. Look how big it is! I mean, that is... That's massive. I need... Uh, how do I turn name tags off? I don't like name tags because... I don't know why, but I don't. Um... Group name tags? I don't know. Okay, there we go. Name tags. Go on. Anyway, let's just get a quick look at this thing. I have to say, that is pretty awesome looking for a Tyrannosaur. Pretty awesome looking indeed. Anyway, guys, we are on another Isle server. This one, I believe, has like 60 or so people on it, so I was like, you know what, we got a lot of people here, why the heck not? Let's just get a hop on, see if we can mess around for a bit, and basically do what we've done for the last two episodes. So yeah, also, if you guys, um, make sure to leave it in the comments, um, let me know if there are any dinosaurs you want to see me play as. No, it is a lot more likely for me to show off herbivores, because herbivores are really easy to level up as, so I mean... If you guys want to see me play uh, Triceratops, for example, pretty likely I will do that. You want to see me play as Ankylosaurs? I'll probably do that. You want to see me play as a Hyper Endocrine T-Rex? Probably never going to happen, because I really, well, with school and everything, I really don't have the time to devote to Isle to get to that level. Nor do I really want to spend that much time playing the Isle. Isle's a great game, but i uh, got other games I'd kind of rather play right now than uh, the Isle. Namely, uh, a game that I might actually be recording this weekend, depending on how things go. Not going to tell you guys what it is, because I'm really not sure if it's going to happen. Not even sure why I'm bringing it up right now, but I am, because why not? Anyway, let's run out here. Ah, uh, beautiful low graphic settings. <laughs> actually, you know what? That's the thing I'd like to know. So I, I asked this in yesterday's episode of Dinosaurs, if you guys still want to see the uh, Aether series continue. I got a, <coughs> excuse me there for a second, um, I got a bit, a bit of a mixed review I'd call it about that. There were some people who were like, yes, please keep the Aether series going, and then there were some who were like, eh, it's not really worth it. Um, and someone did point out something which I already kind of knew, but thank you again for pointing it out. I have built this channel on Minecraft Dinosaurs, so I don't usually expect series to do well, which is why I was surprised when the Aether pilot episode and this pilot episode did really well, because, I mean, I don't expect them to do very well. Anyway, so yeah, the question for this episode is, do you guys want to see me continue the aisle? I mean, I'm fine with doing the aisle. It's a very easy thing to come up and record, because I don't really... I mean, unless it's a specific dinosaur, I don't really have to come on here and, like, do any specific things. I just hop on for a few minutes and then just, you know, banter a bit while I play. I really need to find a friend who has this game, or get convince one of my friends to buy this so then I can play with someone, because... <laughs> I mean, it's a fun game to play by yourself, it's, it's fun, but I think that I'd have more to talk about and more to really do. We'll see. You know what I think I might do? Not this week, but uh, next week, if, if you guys want the series still, next week I think there's another map that I know of that's kind... I think some of you guys will have seen it before, it's basically just like a giant sandy beach with a bunch of trees on the edge and stuff. I might go on that map uh, at some point in the future, just basically to mess around. Let's see, I need to recharge a bit of stamina. Oh yeah, last episode we fought the Utah Raptors, I forgot about that. Yeah. Oh, and someone, I remember, yeah, this was on the last episode, someone was like, uh, when I got killed as a juvenile T-Rex for no reason, someone was like, oh, they just didn't want you to keep become a hyper endocrine Rex. No, that's not why. They just didn't, they were just being jerks. That's legitimately the only reason carnivores hunt other carnivores in this game. Because you saw at the very beginning of this episode, I walked up next to a hyper endocrine. It could have been like, oh, this guy's going to try and become some super dinosaur and kill me. 
But no, no, you, you really only kill another carnivore in this game if either one, you just want to be rude, or two, you're desperately hungry. I don't know. Yeah, it's such a weird noise. Do 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 do. What am I doing? This is the go. <sighs> I I I. I am so looking forward to when creative mode gets back into this game because, I mean, let's see how many progression points we have. We have six points. Only one hundred and fourteen more before I can. Uh, There's something nearby. We will charge into battle. Hyper Undercreen. I kind of want to play a juvenile T-Rex because from what I remember, the uh, sound reading in the change like the sounds got updated. So, yeah. We could attack it. We could very easily attack this thing for no reason other than I just really want to be another dinosaur. We could do that. We could also be really nice and just uh, do something else, but considering we fought a giant battle against Utah Raptors last episode, this sounds kind of fun. Plus, how many other times am I going to be able to take on a Hyper Endocrine Rex? We slowly stalk the prey. Dun 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 Okay. Get ready. In three, two, one, go! He's gonna get away from us! We can catch him! We gotta get him. We're going to attack it. If we can catch him. Which I very highly doubt. Can we catch it? I don't know. I think we. I don't know if we're losing ground or gaining ground. We really should have attacked sooner. Oh. Why is it shouting? Why you shout? Okay, I can't even see it anymore. For such a big dinosaur, you'd think you'd be able to see it for a bit from a bit farther away. Oh, well, there's his footprints. They, I thought those were plants out for a second. <laughs> it's like, wow, that's a big fern. No, that's a footprint. Where is this thing? How did I lose... I completely lost it. Do we see footprints anywhere? No. Wait, N. Wow. I honestly cannot believe I lost it. How did I lose something that big? I mean, you'd think it'd be like, oh, it's a hyper endocrine wreck. I've never heard that roar before. Unless that's the Allosaurus. I. It's been a. I think that's the Allosaur? I honestly can't remember. Is that the Allosaur? I remember the Allosaur had a very haunting roar, which was why, uh, back in the creative mode days of Isle, it was really scary sometimes when you'd be out on the misty lake, which was on an old map. Basically, there was just one map that had a really misty lake in it, and, uh,. It'd be very terrifying sometimes as a herbivore when you'd suddenly just hear this really spooky roar come out of the mist, and it was always an Allosaur, and it was terrifying. Is 
that a bug or is that a dinosaur there? I honestly cannot tell. And I honestly feel like I'm being hunted. Is that dead? It might be dead, whatever it is. Let's run over there. Through the sea. Like a, like a fish. Runs the super horrorosaurus. He's got gills. I just heard something. Must have been me. He's got gills and webbed feet. He can run under the sea because he is aquatic herrerasaur. Ta-da! Yeah! Is that a... No way, is that a dead hyperendocrine? And a herrerasaur. Just wait till we emerge from the water. Oh. Huge leg spike. Oi! You jerk! We are running in circles. How's this guy not taking damage? Well... Well, that's a bit rude. That... See, some people are just jerks. This is proof. Oh, I wanna see. Unlock. Plus. Game. Plus. <laughs> okay, let's see. Tyrannosaurus Rex Juvenile. I heard there were new noises, so I wanna hear him. Oh. Oh, buddy boy, you picked the wrong day to mess with me. I'm gonna get ya. Okay, the luck of this is insane. I think, I think the game. Okay, there's a bigger T-Rex somewhere. But I think the game heard my, my pleas of terror when that horrible little Ostraraptor killed me. And it spawned me back here as a juvenile T-Rex so I could destroy him and make him, like, be... Oh no. It's only advantage is he's somewhat faster. But I've, I, I'm very experienced with hunting these things. Very experienced. He's very... Okay. He's gonna be pretty badly hurt now. Okay. You will pay for your sins! How does it feel? Ha! Sucker! I feel kind of mean now, but at the same time, I really don't. The guy was a jerk to me. I'm allowed to kill him. He, he killed me first. I'm gonna get like... <laughs> please, please don't leave hate in the comments. I, I was, I'm justified in my actions. Yeah, I don't really think there's much of a difference in the sounds. Oh, that's what I heard. Well, I've just realized now that sound I heard that I said... Might have been an Allosaurus.
Um. Okay, I am like terrified. Really wish I hadn't roared just then. Because, oh, okay, there's one there. There's another there. And there's one right there. Um, okay, serious question here. How do you get, like, four endocrines in the same exact area? Is this server, like, glitched or something? There should not be this many endocrine T-Rexes right here. Or hyper-Rexes, whatever you want to call them. Like, this is ridiculous! <laughs> I want to see, what is this guy's? This guy's got decent, decent night vision, decent night vision. Oops, wrong button. What was it? G? Yep, G is the fake limp. I like how the T-Rex uh, does the stalk. That is like, it's just... That's kind of disgusting, just... <laughs> but there's... There's like a herd of them! <laughs> this really shouldn't be in the game! Three of them! That's that's scary. That's too many. That is way too many hyperendocrine rexes. Oh, I remember the good old days when you could actually swim instead of just walking along the ocean floor. Those were the good days. Those were the good days. Well, well, let's just run up and see these things again, I guess, cuz uh I mean, look, their foot is bigger than my face. Like, it's the size of my dude's body. Just its foot. I mean, that's, that, that ah. Ah, that's crazy. It's actually, like, not cool. But there's, I think there are more. Yeah, there are definitely more. Oh, they're calling. That is such a loud call. It's very scary. This is very scary. Let's sneak mode. Okay, there was one right behind me. That is scary. Um, where are they? Like, good grief. It's like age of the hyper endocrine rex. Well, um, I think they, a juvenile joined them. Well, guys, I think we're going to end today's episode here, off here. Uh, thank you guys for watching. Hope you have all enjoyed uh, seeing these multiple tyrannosaurs. Um, and until next time, guys, see ya.